In this video, I'm going to show you how new user account creation in Azure AD can be automated using OnLink. So here I'm using a JSM portal form to submit the request, but this process also works for issue types that are created within Jira. So first let's set up the form. I'm going to set the email address. This is the corporate email account and also the personal email address where the initial instructions will be sent with the temporary password. So let's submit this form. Now let's go to the agent view to look at the ticket. So now this is the view of the IT admin who can review the ticket ensure that the details are correct and then move the ticket into a done or any other status because this is the post function that is configured on the workflow executing behind the scenes so here i can see that the name and address all look good so i'm going to move the ticket to the done status now let's take a look at azure ad so here's my azure let me refresh. And we should see the new user getting created. Here we go, John 45 Smith. And uh, if you look at their status, it's enabled, but their last sign in is still empty. So now I'm going to go to the personal email address that we provided of uh, John. So here's the personal email address and I just received an email here with the login instructions. OnLink automatically sends this email. This template is completely configurable. Uh, we create a temporary password, which is a random set of characters. Uh, and this is dynamic for each new user. So let's try to log in. I'll use the email address provided here. And the temporary password. The first time I try to log in, Azure will ask me to change the password. So let me do that. There we go. There are additional settings that are required, such as two-factor authentication and such. But now John has logged in and their account has been provisioned.